Hey guys, Roxanne here, and today we're going to be doing a really nice, simple, easy trick, which is teaching your dog how to take a bow or to curtsy. So to start out with this trick, you want to have your dog in a standing position. So if they are inclined to always want to sit in exchange for a bit of a treat, just have the treat in your hand and take a few steps backwards. This should prompt them into a standing position. And what you're then going to do is try and do a little bit of a leg stretch and stick your one back foot under their belly area. You are then going to take the treat, direct it onto their nose and push down towards their front paws. And in so doing, as soon as their belly hits the top of your toes, they will be inclined to not want to drop down into a down position and rather maintain Maintain the nice bow after which you can then use the treat to pull them up back into a standing position. So while attempting this you may actually experience that your dog starts to shift its hindquarters back in an attempt to actually avoid your foot. So a good way to combat this is to stand with your dog in between yourself and a wall and use the wall as a barrier so that they can't actually scoot their bums out. Just an important note, your dog might be a little bit freaked out and feel a little bit trapped in a confined space. So really, if you see they're starting to panic, rather avoid this and just work in an open space. Or alternatively, get your dog used to standing in a more confined space by starting a little bit wider and just treating them for being in a position between yourself and the wall. They will soon figure out that this is a happy place where they get lots of treats and should really start to relax about it. Some dogs are fussed by this, others not, so really use your own judgment to make sure that your dog is in no way stressed because a stressed dog cannot learn. So once you see that your dog is happy to be lured into this position, we want to start fading the hand lure as well a little bit. So what I like to do is I simply put my one foot behind the other as though I was curtsying myself so that this will now become the cue for my dog performing the bow motion. This does take a little bit of balancing and dancing skill on your part, but with a bit of practice, you guys will be able to master this so quickly. As a quick side note, guys, if you do notice that your dog is dropping their bum at all, um, simply reduce the amount of time that you have them in this position and start emphasizing that the treat only comes for returning back to a standing position. It's a really nice, quick and easy fun trick for your dog. It's a behavior that they do naturally. So when they do it naturally, you can also give them a bow, curtsy cue, and this will just help reinforce what they've already learned.